Hi guys, today I'll be reviewing a new product in the market that is Essence Concealer. This is how it looks. I got this one from Nykaa and it doesn't come with any outer packaging. This one retails for Rs. 2.99 which is quite affordable. And the thing I would like to say that the packaging says that it has a corrector and a concealer which I disagree with. It was written on the website that one will have a matte finish and another one will have a creamy finish although both of them have creamy finish and let me just give you a closure view. So this is how they look. This looks a little bit dupe of Bobbi Brown uh, corrector and concealer but just leave that part. So if you want to highlight your under eye areas, you can go for this shade. But this one works as a concealer for me at least because and also also one more thing guys if you have grey undertone under eye bags so please use a corrector first and then the concealer otherwise your eyes will look ashy and which you definitely don't want. So let's just get started with the review. It doesn't come with any outer packaging guys that's a little disappointing I think companies should give that and I'm in the shade 10 natural beige let me just swatch with my hands so these are the two colors I'm sure you guys can see it so let me swatch it on my hand guys this one works as a concealer and if you want to bright if you want to highlight your eye area then you can use this color right here this is quite bright i tried using this and this was very bright for me another thing that i want to tell you guys that if you have dark circles with gray undertones please apply a corrector orange corrector first and then apply this concealer um, otherwise it won't work for you so that's how it goes this concealer is super duper blendable guys if you blend it with a brush with a beauty blender it will blend very easily there is no issue with the blending but it, it requires a little more product if you have very big under eye circles or under eye bags that's what i feel also i feel that it doesn't give that much coverage as compared to the fit me one and the age rewinder one so that's what i feel all in all guys if your eye bags are not that big and if you want a good pigmented under eye concealer then you can go for this one and if you want a highlighted one in an affordable budget, budget then definitely you can go for this one i don't feel there is a particular con for it it's just that i have too much big under eye circles and they come with an ashy uh, gray undertone so i didn't like it that much for myself but if you have small eye under eye bags and your undertone is not gray so definitely it will work for you if you have oily under eyes which i don't have so you cannot go for this concealer as it will make your eyes crease very soon so i should not recommend this to you guys people who are with combination skin family and dry skin family they can go for this one as it will make your under eye area quite moisturized as well so that's what i feel this one the darker color you can see and apply it here this is the darkest color in Oh, it is blending very really fast. Super blendable. We'll take this one, just the tiniest amount. So darkest shadow lies here. As you can see that this color is too bright for me, so I won't apply it under my eyes. I need to go office like otherwise I'll have to go to office like this. So I'm going to apply that orange uh, this shade on it so i've applied the concealer under both my eyes and to be very honest guys i really like how creamy this concealer is and how super blendable it is if you are fond of highlighting your features and you want to highlight your under eye area then you can use the lighter shade but i didn't want to do that so i didn't use this one you can definitely do that if you want I hope you like this video guys and please participate in the giveaway going on my channel. So that's it for today guys. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel 